All right, I've just got the um, audio adapter for the Osmo Action. So I've dumped the GoPros because I'm sick to death of them. Just putting my helmet on, might be a bit noisy. But uh, I'm just going to try the mic adapter with the Osmo Action. And I'm uh, going to head up to Cape Tribulation today, do a bit of camping up there. And see what happens. Hopefully the audio is good. Let's go. You can see I've got the uh, Insta360 One X2 just mounted onto the um, screen up here. I have had it on the pole, but uh, it tends to bounce around a lot. I thought I'd just give it a go there. That way I can uh, get video going down the road. I get video coming back to me as well. And providing the audio is working okay with this Osmo action, well then you folks back at home can be watching it on that one while I'm talking on this one and vice versa. So, fingers crossed, it's all good. A bit of cloud starting to build up, but uh, that's probably still normal for this time of the year. I think we should be right. If, even if it does rain uh, while I'm up camping at Cape Tribulation, it'll probably just be a little bit of you know, afternoon shower. I don't think it'll be too much. Here we are, just like last week's video. We're back on the uh, coast road to Port Douglas. Uh, not as nice as it would be, but still uh, quite a cracker day, I reckon. So, let's have a look here. So, to Cape Tribulation, we should get up there about one o'clock today. We might have a few stops along the way. Uh, it's about an hour and a half, probably an hour 45 from Cairns. Get over 100 kilometres, maybe 140 kilometres from Cairns. So, uh, yeah.
this one, Mildy. One way. Yep. Yep, on pay wave. Too nice of a day to be working. No? Cheers. We're over the ferry. We're on the Daintree Riverside, Cape Tribulation side of the Daintree. Um, a few more cars coming off the ferry. We're going to head up that way as well. I might have a drink of water and a banana or something here. Let all these vehicles get out of our way so we haven't got traffic in front of us. All right, next stop, Noah Beach. Well, if you're locked up in your house somewhere due to COVID anywhere in the world, you can sit back, I'm pretending you're riding my motorbike now and uh, you're going through the oldest living rainforest in the world, the Daintree. So I hope you're enjoying it. If you are, uh, give it the thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new here. So uh, you don't miss out on anything else. Like I said, I enjoy making, well I enjoy going for the ride, so I might as well make a video while I'm down it. And that one day might make a little bit of passive pocket money out of it. There's a uh, mango walk down through here, a Madja botanical walk, that's quite nice. I'm not going to go down there today. But all of the creek, and uh, that walking track actually comes, I'll show you where it goes, it goes all, right along the, uh, the creek here, all the creek. But, have a look at that, isn't that pretty impressive? I probably just need to keep an eye at the car coming, time to go. But uh, the campground is actually not too far away, it's just up here high, even leave the cameras on, we're that close to it. We've got this little windy bit for uh, probably about a minute. And then we'll sneak straight back in, uh, straight back in, we'll just sneak straight into the uh, campground. I was going to find number 12. Now the campground at Noah Beach, it is right on the uh, right on the beachfront. So we're probably about 50 metres from the water's edge. So hopefully there's no hungry crocodiles walking around tonight. Hopefully there's other campers there. You know the saying, safety in numbers. 
how's this, uh, how's this ride or if you drive, if you're driving a car through here? Just beautiful. I don't know if the uh, cameras here are doing it justice or not. Hopefully I can find some nice uh, rainforesty backdrop music on Soundstripe to put aboard this uh, footage. If you are a YouTuber and you are making your own videos, I'm just chucking my own little plug in here. I've got a 10% uh, discount code for Soundstripe, so if you, if you like the music you've been listening to, there is a uh, link, oh no, a link, there's a um, code down, I'll just put it down the bottom there. So Midlife Adventure, that'll get you 10% uh, off. Now there's one entrance here, I think that's the way out. No, uh, might have been the way in. But we'll go in the other entrance. I'm pretty sure it goes around that one. Yeah, so if you do like the music and you want to uh, subscribe, I've uh, got an affiliate, like I said, I've got that affiliate link for Soundstripe, you'll get 10% off. If I get a tiny little kickback, help support the channel. Pays for my coffee addiction and my uh, motorbike petrol. There you go, no entry. Exit only. Let's go this way, shall we? Number 12 we want, I think it's 15, there's 15. That'll be 15, must be like 13, 14, 12 must be the next one on the left. We'll take that one, I think. Now this looks like home for the next day. Number 12, woohoo, this is us. Doesn't look like too many other people out here. The um, campsites all looked um, relatively booked out, actually. I don't know why. Can we get around through here? Let's give it a go, shall we? Might come around this way. And then I can put... Um, and I should be able to hang my... Flap off my tent. Off the bike. Might be the go. So I'll make sure there's no big tree branches. No, we'll be right here, I think. This looks alright to me. Alright, this is going to be home sweet home. I might chuck my camp up because it does look a bit rainy out there. Um, once my tent's up, we might even throw the drone up. Oh no. Tent time. I've got my camp set up at Noah Beach there, um, just here behind us, look, there's the tent, so uh, it's not rainy, not yet anyway, so hopefully it holds off, we don't get too wet, but um, down this track here is the beach, I'm going to go for a walk down and uh, see what I can see, hopefully no crocodiles, let's go shall we. You can see the old warning signs there. Chung, warning, crocodiles, <laughs> attacks may cause injury or death, mm, it doesn't sound like much fun, and if the crocodiles don't get you don't worry, the stingers will, um, marine stingers, <laughs> not kind of deadly up here, if you go up to um, the Gulf of Carpentaria, a bit more further north out in the uh, west coast of Queensland, you get the box golf jellyfish, and um, and yeah, they'll kill you. <laughs> but apart from that, everything else up here is pretty, pretty good. Well, here we go, Noah Beach. That's uh, only a stone throw from my camp. It's a bit hazy. I might, um, I might throw the drone up tomorrow morning, I think. There you go, Noah Beach. Not too shabby. Looks like a couple of people about 500 metres up the uh, other end of the beach there. But it's pretty secluded. I think I've got most of this order myself. Can't argue with that. Six bucks for the night. Beautiful ride up here along the coast. 
So uh, I might uh, get my gas stove out, cook a bit of dinner up. I was going to throw the drone up. Uh, it is a bit hazy. I don't know if you can see it in this video here. Um, especially looking back down that way. It's just that kind, I don't know if it's humidity haze, whatever it is, but um, hopefully tomorrow morning it's not raining or anything and it's nice and sunny and I might get the drone up then. But yeah, Noah Beach, not too shabby. I'm gonna go, uh, it's getting on. What time is it? 20 past five. I might go uh, cook some dinner, I think. that's breakfast done and uh, had a pretty good sleep last night. Didn't rain too much, had a very light shower probably for about um, three or four minutes this morning, bit of a drizzle. But uh, yeah, I think we might pick up the camp, we'll go up to Cape Tribulation, so just back out on the road here, head up north a bit, it's not that far, something like 10 minutes. And um, have a look and then we'll, I don't know, just maybe ride back to Cairns. Just a nice quick overnight camping trip in the rainforest. All right, let's pack this camp up and get going, shall we? Okay, I've changed the, um, my microphone set up on the uh, Osmo Action a little bit, so hopefully, hopefully, it's a bit better audio. I think what was happening is I had the microphone right, right in front of my mouth and my lips were pretty much all touching it, so uh, that's probably why I was getting a lot of um, popping, like really high gain. That's what it, well, that's what it seemed like to me, it just seems to be really high gain. All right, here we go. We'll chuck a right here and go up to um, Cape Tribulation. Oh, stunning day again. Let's go.
All right, just coming back in the cans. If you've got any questions or anything you want to know, just uh, drop a comment down below. I'll get back to pretty much for all of them. And uh, ride safe, and we'll see you all in the next one. Till then, be good. Just down this track here. Now, how do I move that? Aha, yeah. uh -huh. now I'm all over it. Right, I've got my camp set up at Noah Beach there.